Hey everyone and welcome to another episode of Eden Destination Roulette, where I try to win as many rounds as possible with Eden while going to randomized destinations. Today, for a streak of 17, I'm bringing you a run to Mega Satan through the boss rush. Right off the bat, I'm having a really, really bad time here with the very first room. I don't know what was up with that. I usually don't get hit that much in that room. But that immediately puts me to one and a half hearts, and that's not where it stops either. So this first, first floor was actually quite a sweat. After that, it got a bit better. Uh, with me finding one of my favorite use items in the game in particular. So that's going to be a pretty exciting one. And later on, the run turned into a really interesting pew pew laser build. So a very nice one <clears throat> with a nice twist ending at the Mega Satan fight. There was something that happened right at the end of the run that actually was really, really exciting. So make sure to watch the video to the end to see what it is. And as for my question of the day, which is your favorite book item to use in the game? Let me know in the comments. As always, I hope you enjoy the video. And if you do, don't forget to like and subscribe. I don't really care about that. Even if our starting set is a bit of an anti-synergy. Floor one steam sale would be kind of nice. No take, it is actually good. Dashing into an enemy or boss picks it up and slams in the ground, slam deals damage and spawns rock waves based on ice axe size. You're invincible during the dash and slam. Look, if I find hearts, I'm gonna go and take it, but at one heart, I don't wanna risk that. Not again. Dude, what are these ricochets? I even have negative, uh, I even have negative shot speed. How am I getting so many bounces here? Man. Really hoping for money. It's really open for money, so I can uh, buy that steam sale. At this point, I'm lucky if I can buy the soul heart. Listen to miss. Okay, that might actually be the single most stupid thing anyone's ever said in my chat. Oh god. Dude, what is this AI? I don't understand how these guys move sometimes. He just stopped on the spot and changed directions. <laughs> Lock up. Perks? Oh, thank the lord. <laughs> okay, fine. We have Spelunker hat. I'll give Suplex a shot. I'll give Suplex a shot. So, hold up. I need to assign something. Okay, okay, so the the direction I'm moving in decides the direction I suplex, not the direction I'm firing tears in. Oh! Oh, you have to let it- oh, I see. That seems wildly dangerous. Uh, okay, 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 okay. okay. Oh! And before anyone says her, her, you would have died there without that full health pill. No, I wouldn't have because uh, I would not have taken suplex here. <laughs> that room would have gone wildly different <laughs> if I was at half heart. Hers of the mozzie. All right, oh, hold up. Always got to try that. Okay, it is a mega Satan run, so I won't be allowed into a devil deal. Dude. 
Like, I, I get why people like this item and why it's fun, but an item that constantly has me... leaves me inside an enemy... It's just not great. Like... Basically, if Suplex doesn't kill, you're immediately at risk of getting tapped. Although the rock destroying properties are fun. I'll give it that. Ooh, Dry Baby. I love Dry Baby. You know my stance on Dry Baby. Yeah, real funny game. Hell. Oh, wow. Good, good, good job, probs. Hold up, I want Dry Baby to do the job. Even if it means getting hit. Okay, fine. I'll suplex them. Bonk. Yeah, I mean, you you just gotta pick your suplex spots. It's a fun item. I'm glad we picked it up. You know, having Spelunker hat on top of the the Book of Secrets definitely made it a lot easier too. If I don't have the Spelunker hat there, I, there's no way I'm trading a Book of Secrets for a suplex though. No way in the world. <laughs> Excuse me? What? You know what? Just for that, you're gonna you're gonna stay away. Man, that, that's the thing that could have cost me the entire run uh, destination, right? Because you need to hit that Basement 2 Devil Deal. You need that Devil Deal on Basement 2 on a, on a Mega Satan run. I mean, who could have possibly thought that an item that has you touching enemies all the time could be bad? <laughs> Dang it. It's okay, we can recover from this. Yeah, we're just gonna hit the thing and it's fine. Now that we've seen the devil deal, we have a much harder time... Actually, uh... Oh man, that's a lot of hearts. That's a lot of hearts to play that thing with. Butter. I could also just straight up get uh, uh, the key pieces here, although that seems really unlikely. Oh man, getting those hearts before defeating the boss would have been so nice. Should I go to the store? I mean, there's a potential for another heart in there. See, I can't keep going now because if it teleports me to the Devil Deal, I'm in a really bad spot and I don't actually have the health to keep playing, so... That was just a waste of time.
Binky is nice though, and we're on Angel Rooms now because we we got lucky and hit the Devil Deal, so I'll take it. This is okay, and we ended with two Soul Hearts and a somewhat solid build, so I thought I could make it. Dang it! Blasting cap. 10% chance for exploding bombs to drop a bomb. Why not? I don't have a trinket. Yo, Dry Baby, this would be a fantastic time to go off, not gonna lie. Retrovision? Oh no. I'm sorry, chat. Is that a tinted rock below me? I can't tell. DK, my screen stayed the same, then maybe you should try upping the bitrate. <laughs> Thanks, Dry Baby. Appreciate it. Ooh. Okay, look, one more pill from the the pill bottle, and then it's sharp straw time. Especially with 4.47 damage already. That's just bananas. That is just bananas. Oh boy. How did that hit me, dude? It's really not my run. <laughs> Pretty sure this is some of the worst gameplay I've shown in the last year. But it's okay, because I keep pulling these full health pills, so... <laughs> I don't need to worry. What? Three? <sighs> Better lucky than good. Yep, that was always my uh, motto when I was racing the game too. Wow, I'd have to pay two bombs and a key to open that chest over there. I, I don't think that chest, chest can possibly be that good. That's gotta be good. I wonder if the, the sharp straw can charge itself. Okay, I don't usually like these because they're only worth half a heart, but they do protect my devil chance, so... Nope, doesn't charge itself. Sad. Godhead is in that chest. You check the seed. That's impressive. Cheater. I don't need that, though. I'm just gonna find Godhead in the devil deal. Beep.
Thanks, Dry Baby. But seriously, why is Sharp Straw so good? Missed the 36 percent. Yeah, thirty-six percent. Get the pentagram though. That's nice. That further increases my injury room chance down the road. This is gonna be a long run, ladies and gents. Identified Pell and a Soul Heart. All right. Soul Heart is nice, at least. Devil card. Don't really need any of these, so let's just go. This run is solid so far. It's just gonna be the ever, ever so famous sweat to get the keys. I don't have bombs either, so I'm gonna have to find one before going to the boss room. Why does completing the room not charge sharp straw anyway? How does that make sense? Honestly, chest room is probably one of the best things I can find right now. That should have a pretty high likelihood of giving me bombs. Chemical peel, plus two damage on the left eye. Isn't that our... Oh, right, 4.5 volt. That's why it's not charging. Um, okay. Interesting. It did give me bombs. I wasn't wrong. Jesus. He's a hearts. Okay, hold up. I'll be back. That soul heart chance is just too tempting. Oh, yeah. I'm absolutely using that here. <laughs> I don't call it the room for nothing. I'm going to take that. Not a single soul heart. That's a bit sad. Do, do. I was hoping for greed. But I guess this works. I have newfound respect for the notched axe after that run we had recently where we started with it. But not enough respect for it to drop the sharp key. Bro, what? <laughs> That's not okay. That is not okay. Type one in chat if you think that's not okay. I guess I don't, I shouldn't be relying on Twitch chat to be on my side, but a man can hope. Surprise that doesn't one shot the little poops. Well, that's okay.
In two shots, the little poops. Ooh. Yeah, I'm gonna be playing this for a bit. There's the engine room. It's void. <laughs> mm. What do these rotten hearts do? They count as half a red heart. They protect your devil deal. And if you lose one, you get like two to four flies. touch you but I don't really care about taking you with me not really any point in going to the curse room huh just want to grab some health all the health oh, it seems like kind of a Oh, you got to fly for every room we clear? Really? I didn't know that. Uh, I guess we got some min-maxing to do here. I was about to say the blood bag would just be too sweet with that massive speed up, so... We got to go for it with all those hearts sitting on the ground. Curse of the Mozzie once more. What the? Oh. The no trinket, that's actually pretty good. I'm a-okay with uh, running this sharp straw all the way to the end. Let's go. No makes it so space use items can never spawn again. Well, as long as I'm holding the thing. That, that's actually a huge trinket once you're, you're set on your use item. And honestly, even if you're not set on your use item, because passives are so much more essential in beating a run. But right now, it's even better. Okay. Read why. Oh, you redeemed the hydrate? Whoops. Hold up. Was that a lock-up pill? Hold up, I'm gonna check. Let me get the rest of my of my cherry banana juice. Nobody redeem a hydrant anymore. I'm out of out of liquids now. All right, good job, chat. Oh, a bar key I think. Uh, we call it key bar here, but you probably mean the exact same thing. I said nobody redeem a hydrate. Now I gotta get more delicious uh, fruit juice. How dare you make me get more drinks. Unbelievable chat. I thought we were friends. Oh, what the hell? Dude, I'm so good at this game. Huge banana key ba or baki banana key. Yeah, exactly. That's why I said it's probably the same thing you said. Easy peasy. 
Sharp Straw actually really good in this fight. Alright, come on, just give me the second. No? Okay. Okay, I'm gonna get a new drink and then we're gonna continue this. Alrighty, let's pick this back up. Just beat the boss, didn't get an angel room. We've got a nice amount of coins too. All right. <laughs> Wafer again. And the second key piece. Please answer my question. What was your question? Can we extend the stay hydrated to shots on every weekend? Yeah, we can do that. What, really? Yeah, because I don't stream on weekends. <laughs> I mean, I'm not gonna get drunk every uh, every stream on weekends. Like, <laughs> I'm not gonna do that. Why would I do that? It's only 500 channel points too. <laughs> like, you get that in like what an hour or so. <laughs> It's a bit of downtime segment anyway. My life goal would be to make you drunk in 15 minutes. Yeah, I don't. I really don't drink a lot of alcohol either, so. Wouldn't take much to get me drunk, but yeah, I'm not. I'm not doing that. Thanks, Fry Baby. This is depth two, right? Okay. <laughs> Did I ever do a drunk stream? No. Like I said, I barely drink any alcohol, so there's not really much of an incentive for me to do that. I don't enjoy the taste of alcoholic drinks in general, like. I used to enjoy some, but never a lot of them, and nowadays uh, most of them just disgust me. Alright. These are okay. Not even cocktails? There's some good cocktails, that's true. But even then, I usually go for the ones that are lighter on, on the alcohol, except... Uh, what, what is it called? Is it Long Island Iced Tea? No. The one with rum and cola. Cuba Libre. That, that one's amazing. The key to alcohol is eventually it will taste like water. No, I don't doubt that. But that still, that still makes me not like the initial taste. Probs like me can taste alcohol through anything. I really can. Oh, 
I probably don't want to full clear this floor. I want to at least, like, see if there's anything here still. First room for my last soul heart? Yeah, sure. Man. First rooms are where it's at. Whoops. Well, there goes my angel room chance. I like beer, but I'm also from Bavaria. Might be my genes. I mean, I usually get get uh, some flack from Twitch chat for being a German that does not like beer. But I can't help it. I just don't. Man, I'm not having a good run here. Okay, it's dark room path. So we take this. It's a much more dangerous path too. So I, I, I still need to uh, be on edge here. Because this is not a one run by any means if I keep playing like this. Although almost 12 damage and the straw definitely help. And tech point five. I don't like beer to get drunk because it's just highly inefficient. Are you an engineer by chance? <laughs> or like some other field that involves a lot of math? Does that increase like the charge rate of my thing? No. Maybe also kinda, all right. No problems, it's called poor. But I mean, the stronger alcoholic beverages are also a lot more expensive, right? Is it really more cost efficient to get drunk off of strong booze? Like, I legitimately don't know as somebody who doesn't drink a lot. It's probably more cost efficient. They don't cost like that much more, I guess. You can get really shitty cheap one gun. Okay, fair enough. A bottle of one guys better uh, is, is cheaper than a case of beer. Okay, 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 you got me there, chat. You got me there. But you know what? I got stigmata. So who really won this argument? If you don't care about the taste at all. I mean, the question was purely about cost efficiency, right? Oh my god. Okay, I'm thinking we're gonna have to drop the no thing. There's not too many items that I'm gonna get at this point anyway. Obviously, all my chest items are now gonna be actives, but that's okay. Or Actually, hold up. We're not going to the chest. We're going to the, to the dark room. Is it better to have the no trinket for that? I mean, it would be nice to have it, but again, the, the booger trinket is just so good against, especially against bosses and especially against Mega Satan. Like even more so against Mega Satan than other bosses. The taste of hard liquor. Bro, 
Really, I couldn't wait for the eyeballs to spawn before I used my sharp straw. That was not a great play. Anyway, just plant yourself firmly behind Rotten Baby and you're fine in this fight. Ladder would be phenomenal here. I mean, you could just flat out give me God Hit or Sacred Heart, but the Angelic Ladder would be absolutely bonkers here. Hollowed Ground. Okay. That's not quite either of the two. But I guess I don't need keys, so I might as well. Actually, I don't even need to dig for a... I don't even need to dig for a magic mushroom here because I already have Cricket's head. Ah! Easy enough. Are there any games that you are looking forward to? Actually, currently no. Not at all, but I'm sure that's only a matter of time until that changes. I have 4.5 volt, right? Well. <laughs> Sulfur is actually more exciting here than Brimstone. Blarg! Okay, he just wanted to show me he had the bigger one. Damn it. <laughs> I concede, Satan. <laughs> Actual laser measuring contest with Mega Satan. My beam <laughs> I hate how the beam doesn't get bigger past the second use, but I like how the damage keeps going up. Look at that, 26.64 damage. What game do I wish for a sequel for? I like, th th I feel like this is a really hot take. But I kind of wish the Legend of Zelda formula would return to what it was. Like, I'm just not an open world person, you know? 
so Breath of the Wild and Tears of the Kingdom never really piqued my interest. So I kind of wish it returned to the old formula. Um, then I would be looking forward to an upcoming Zelda game. Alright, GG.